Today's episode, we're talking about something that's not very exciting, but it's super important, backing up your files. Dropped off the daughter at school. Now me and the son are going to go, we're going to download some cards. Come on, buddy. Yeah. What? I'm going to push my hot wheels. Yeah. What are you doing, pal? Now let's go do this. Let's go back up some weddings. Salmoni here of Learn, Laugh, Shoot. Backing up your files was one of the most important aspects for a photography business, whether you're shooting weddings, portraits, even for your personal photos. I still get in trouble because a ton of our family photos were on a computer that crashed and we didn't have a backup. I couldn't tell you how important it is. That's why I've developed a multi-tier system here for how we back up our wedding photos. All starts in the camera. Shoot raw and JPEG. Yeah, you don't have to shoot the finest JPEG, we shoot medium JPEG, but the fact that when I go home and I can download every photo I took twice into different locations easily is huge. Now it doesn't matter if you have two card slots, it does make it easier because they're shot to two separate cards and then you instantly have a backup while you're taking the pictures. But even if you have that single card slot, when you get home late at night and you're tired, you can just sit down, stick your card in and bring all your JPEGs to one hard drive, bring all your raw files to another hard drive. Now the real true heart of my backup system is our RAID drive, which we use a Drobo Pro. It's not available anymore. There are newer versions of it, which we're looking into for next year, but it's just having the ability to have eight drives in one machine that the data is backed up across those eight drives. So if I had to lose two, back, two drives before a total meltdown is huge because having everything on one drive, especially an external drive, that sucker flies off the desk, gone, done. No more pictures. Uh, yeah, Drobo is right now running around like, I think like $500, but it's a great investment. Um, there's other companies too from LaCie and a couple, and I think Seagate, you know, research and invest in what you're most comfortable with. You know, if you can go to a photo show like WPPI or Photo Plus in New York, you know, visit the booths. I'm gonna tell you how crucial it is to have something spread across multiple drives. The final part, and I find one of the most important parts of our backup system, off-site backup. We use a company called Zenfolio, which we've used for a couple of years now, and they're awesome. You can either pay by month, by the year, but we've been doing off-site backup probably since 2002 with a company called Pictage, and unfortunately isn't around anymore. But I had 10 years of weddings on there, and sometimes it was easier, especially with an older wedding, if a client called up from five years ago and said, Dave, Dave, I wanna buy a large print. You know, instead of me booting up or finding an old drive, you know, I can go right online and say, I need number 52, and I can request a download, download it in like 10 minutes, get it sent to the lab and print it out for the client. Uh, also the fact of having something not where you are, so this way something were to happen, whether a fire or something happened to your business, you have a robbery, you always have a backup. Multiple backups, redundancy is key with any great backup strategy. Let me know how you back up your files. Share your strategies down in the comments. If you like what you heard today, click the subscribe button, give us a thumbs up, and we'll see you on the next episode. Thanks for watching.